Hello everyone from Future Gems. I'm recording this the day after the release of Volamore because there was so much to record and to do yesterday that I still haven't got this video out until now. But here it is. This is going to include a bunch of quests and just me exploring the region, figuring out any new mechanics that I come across along the way. It's thieving stuff, prayer stuff, the dungeon a bit, perilous moons. Generally, this video is just an exploring and discovery, but I'm also going to be doing all four of the quests that were released with Valamore during it, so a bit of a split between two different things. But yeah, so far I've been really enjoying the content, and I can't wait for you all to see what I experienced. Enjoy the video. Hello there, everyone. I'm not sure if this intro will get used. I'm not sure what part of a video it's going to be. All I know, Volmore just released, and I'm excited to get into it. So that's what we're going to do. And yeah, there's some person over by the west gate. I got given a letter that told me that. I did see it in the video they released as well during server downtime. Okay, so we got this dweeb. Oh shit, nothing's going to be in quest helper. I'm going to have to read. Ugh. Let's go. Okay, so <laughs> no, no cutscene for the birds. You just. You're, you'd never actually see yourself on a bird. Uh, the fuck am I meant to do now? Up the stairs to the palace. Guessing that might be this place. Unless it's that place. No, this is a museum. Oh, this is so weird having the content that's actually, like, new. It's a bit like, I, I didn't really know Zaya at all when I came back. Who's this chick? Oh, okay. Well, I was hoping to see the king, but... The Twilight's Promise? Oh, is that it? Are we meant to be outside? There was some... Oh, here we go, Tullus. I want to do just this first one at least, because I think that unlocks some transport system. The bird transport system. I'm not going to try and pronounce everything in this. South of here. Other side of the bazaar. Prince, it's the prince I'm looking for, not the king. Okay, so the other side of the bazaar, south of here. Is there anything at the bazaar that's interesting? New shops are always interesting to me as an iron man, so... Baker, nothing there. Fur merchant, silk merchant, that's a lot of different furs. Just normal silk. It's another way to get it though, which might be like a way to get it for the RD Easy Diary. Which is an interesting thing to know. This guy got nothing. Either that or it's bought out. Nothing interesting anyway. Spice, get garlic here. Oh, the estate agents. Is there a house portal here? I don't know what the icon looks like. No, there's no house portal anywhere on Valmore. Weird that they have an estate agent. Might be for future stuff. I'm sort of just checking things out at the minute. Twilight's promise though. Probably got to be the first goal. I think I, wa I want to go check out Perilous Moons after that. But I'm guessing we have to have done... Yeah, we have to have done Twilight's promise anyway, so... I also want to check out the Coliseum, but like, I don't know how far I'll be able to even get into it. Right, who am I actually looking for here again? Oh shit, this is so weird having to look in the quest log. In the temple. Temp this looks like a temple. There's so many people around that it's hard to see, like, NPCs. I'd better head down there. Here he is. You know what, as weird as it is, I want to be immersed right now. And I think the best way to do that is to hide other people. And I'll just be able to see better. I'll know what uh, I'm looking at. It'll be a lot easier. This guy sounds a bit mental. Thanks for pointing out the obvious. Head up to the palace and find the twins. They dealt with all the fun admin work. I don't know where those knights get. It's definitely the twins that are the bad guys, obviously. But whatever, we'll go interrogate some knights or talk nicely to them. Whatever tickles you fancy. Am I meant to have, like, combat equipment for this? Combat level 40. Not really. Oh, I want to, should we see if we can see someone who's getting distracted by a kid? I need to hide all this 2D as well. I want to find somebody who's getting distracted and rob them, just because it sounds like a fun new feature. Because you can auto pickpocket if this person. Oh, that's crazy! Oh, it actually tells you as well, you know, it's an urgent distract a wealthy citizen nearby. Look at this, it's going insane! I'm just going to see how long it goes. Okay, so it stopped after 12. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. We got 1k from it. 
And sometimes you get a key as well, which lets you rob someone's house or something. I don't know where all the kids are. There's one. Here we go. If we don't get a key this time, I'll, I'll stop and carry on. I'm just curious. Oh, we got an easy clue. I wonder if there's clue steps in, uh, in Valamoya. Right, we were going to the palace. I guess if we had rugs on that, would probably be pretty good, right? Like the rugs outfit. You just have to find an area where it's like concentrated with the kids. Where'd they go? They were out here before. Oh. Oh god, I just left to go look them up. Okay. We'll do the bazaar first, because that's down here, and then we can go to the others in the east. To convince two knights from the bazaar. One from the bazaar, two. Where are the knights? Knight of Valmore. Did they just give me something else to do? Pickpocket nearby citizens. Oh, we got a key. Not looking for the key now, I'm looking for this quest item, but... How do you know where they go? Can you just get into any wealthy household? Is this a wealthy household? No, this is a tower. What am I doing? That looks like a wealthy house. Thieving activity. They're on the map. You give us another distraction, kid. Or maybe it's regular citizens I want to pop pickpocket not the wealthy ones oh got a distraction coming it does say citizen not wealthy citizen so i'm not sure this is the right thing to be doing yeah i'm gonna try this key or is this not right time yeah yeah yeah, yeah. you gotta go when they're not in okay how do you know that's so weird couple down here gonna kiss the joint out make sure they're not home lord everyone's home no one hasn't been home yet. Hey, oops, that door's locked. In we go. So what do we do? Just loot everything. Okay. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Ah, dodgy character outside the bank. You can exchange them for GP. I noticed something somewhere else in the house. Oh. I don't know how long I'm meant to stay in here. I don't want to get caught and, like, lose everything. Oh, I have to use a window to get out? What the fuck? Okay, so I need to... Valamore West Bank. It's just up here. Just pickpocket every citizen I, I come across. Okay, there's a dodgy character. Oh, is it... Am I talking to the wrong thing? Okay. 40. Right. Whatever. Okay, we need to... We need to find this... This quest item. Maybe I should pickpocket different people. Definitely said citizen. Oh, I got it. Okay. Okay, so I think that's one set of them done. The Cothan, the Colosseum, and the Outer Fortis Pub. And so that's that one. Should we go do that one by the gate? I don't like this. They changed the jewellery thing, so it's all in one thing. But, like, this always shows, which I dislike. Maybe make it just when you have cosmics in your invent. Where's the pub? I'm already lost. So weird having new things to explore. All the way over here. Not sure if we had a source of sweet corn in the world before. What well, do now? Charcoal on a table as well. Interesting. Hey, they're following me. Okay, there's a fountain over here. Oh, what? Or oh, master farmers as well. Okay, so we got them ones. So the Colosseum and the Cothan. This is the Cothan and this is the Colosseum. So we're good. We're in the right place already, pretty much. There's another bank over this side as well. Let's see what this shop is. Something crafting, maybe. Always gotta check out stock as an iron man. Okay, so this is a, a new place. I don't know what a bolt mold's for. This is a new place to potentially get various molds if you're on some sort of weird restricted account, I guess. Like if you can't get to Alcarid in leaks, for example, but you can get to Valamore. It's a potential option. Wait, are we just going in the Colosseum? Oh, shit. I uh, don't know if I see any night. Oh, there's that there. Two attack styles. Uh, there's a bank here. This guy wants me to beat him up. So, we're going to. Oh, I can't use the bank? That's annoying. Alright. I'm sure I'm way over prepped for this, but whatever. This guy's fucked. Well, he got cooked. While we're here, should we see if we can, like, go in and do a wave or two? Okay, we don't have, like, any equipment right now, any gear or supplies. I'm just, uh, I just, I want to know if we can just do a wave. I want to see what the first wave looks like. A rookie approaches. Okay, let's begin. No modifiers. Am I supposed to have modifiers? 
Priority is run by 20% of damage received. Enemies never miss and are hitting extra 1 damage. Maximum HP is reduced by 10%. No longer be boosted. That's fine. I'll go with that. I don't know if we're on the right style or... Oh, a shaman. Hey, oops. There's fucking tons of them. Jesus. There's four different people who just attacked me. A shaman and a seer. So yeah, you definitely want your pre mage on there, don't you? Wow, I just got absolutely slammed. Okay. Oh, well, that's what the Coliseum looks like. Gonna head back there in a bit, of course. Right now, though, I just want to go finish this quest off. I don't think it's a very long one. Okay, so we've just got the one at the Cothan. Whatever that is. I guess it's a dock. Where the knights at? Where the knights at? Where the knights at? That's it. I didn't put the thing. Put the thing back in the bank. The crest. Okay. On the docks rather than on a ship. Isn't part of the stack. Directly next to two barrels of fish opposite a bench. Okay, that is quite specific. There's two barrels of fish there and a bench. Or over there. Or over there. I think it's actually that one. Pretty sure it's this one. It said directly next to opposite a bench and that's the closest description. Alright, we got all the knights. Nothing new in this shop. Search their quarters within the headquarters. Where the fuck's that? Oh, it's there. Am I in the right building? Yes. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to punch you, bro. I'm sorry. Yeah, I still think it's those two dweebs downstairs. The twins. Never mind, we found out who's guilty. Oh, no, wait, no. That could uh, that could be planted there by the Tullius. As they told us to look in here. It's definitely still them. Definitely still them. That's not true. She just straight up killed her. Okay, it's definitely them. I say you're guilty, so you just die. But uh, can I not prove these guys guilty? I know it's them. It's obvious. Which guy am I meant to talk to? Regular Centaur. Him. Oh, you can build new land inside. That's interesting. Is is this for Renu? That's cute. Feed the burp. It's quite scary, really, isn't it? But that was a cute animation. I reckon she'll let you ride her now. Hey, oops. Hey, oops. Okay, this is kind of hard to see. Is this my plugin? No, this is the actual map. Interesting. Very interesting decision. <laughs> uh, I guess we go to the tier map. I don't know if that finishes the quest or if we have to turn it into him. Okay. Well, thank you, Renu. No, to, oh, there they are. The dweebs. <laughs> Since the death of the last emperor. Hmm. Okay. I don't think that might. Yeah. These two are stupid as fuck. Right, so all I've learned in this quest so far is that these two, absolute fucking idiots. Absolutely brain dead, both of them. Completely brain dead. I hope the queen's better, because these two, these, they're a fucking mess. Right, who the fuck's Metzley then? Yeah, these people are all called Nell too. Who's Metzley? You didn't tell me where Metzley was. Are we just gonna guess? They're all called Nelta. Why are they all called Nelta? They've all got the same fucking name. Is that like a monk? Is that what that means? Yeah, I'm looking for Metzley. Any idea where the fuck he is? Can you heal me? Okay, fuck this guy. Don't tell me anything. Nell uh, Metzley! Oh, it's she. Yeah, I got bored of reading. I'm just gonna check the quest log. Wait. Cutscene. What's happening? I don't have any weapons. Alright, kill some dweebs. These cultists are rubbish, honestly. The fact that I'm just pun punching them to death, like, shows how much they're worth, doesn't it? I'm guessing this attack is just sort of a distraction for something or other, though. Yep, there we go. Hope he's dead, he was a fucking idiot. Alright, that is the quest. Oh, um, oh, somebody nearby just. People are lost, so I'm helping them out. But I don't have my... Okay, people are following me. Alright, well that is a quest done. We did, uh... We did that thing. I don't know what the next one is. Or if it's even out yet. But I know I want to do this. So I'm meant to go to Cantorum, which I'm right next to. There is a bank down here. Perilous Moons as well. And there's a transport thing, okay. I think we just send a run. Oh shit, can I not get down there? That's so troll! Wait, no, there's a shortcut, there's a shortcut. Climb rocks. Let's go. 
Big brain. Ah, so how do we build these? Is it gonna tell me what I need? Ten feed sacks. How do you get Quetzal feed sacks? All right, we have started the next quest. I think I'm actually gonna have a spliff break before I move on to it. Oh, so I still can't go in yet? I wanted to bank. The outflow spring. Guess it's one of these. All right then. I feel like I'm gonna need gear for this, but we'll see. I don't know exactly where it is I'm going. I'm just gonna have a wonder. Someone doing Hunter down there on the new Salamanders. I feel like it's it's this. Oh, it's this. I'm guessing. Can I get a kill crew? Oh, I missed it. This is how we're doing Valamoy all. We're just punching everything to death with full grace. <laughs> Let's go. Gonna let me in the city now. I still wanna know how you get Quetzal feed. So many unanswered questions. Let's go. What are we doing now? Jessamine in north of the city. Combat level 75. I'm gonna get some actual gear. So there is a bank in here. Somewhere. Another human. How are you trash talking me? I just got here. Yeah, that wasn't necessary. Fuck this guy. Can I beat him up? No. I'm gonna punch a guard. I'm pissed off. Okay. I can only talk to them. That's weird. Why do none of them like me, man? They're all haters out here. The fuck? Let's see what's in the magic shop. It's in case there's runes. Are people just gonna talk shit to me the entire time I'm here? Okay, there's death runes, law, no cosmics. Nothing really. Stop talking! This is annoying! I hope when we finish the quest they don't keep talking shit. Alright, let's just get some random melee gear. Okay, but I'm gonna keep the graceful one for now. Uh, is there an Ola here? No. Okay, don't know if I'll need anything else, but I'll do for now. Jessamine. Okay, so I'm just meant to go in, I guess. Talk to the tree inside. Is this just like a tutorial of it? Because if it is, that's great. I like the random D20 in the middle. Is it a D20? No, that's a... That's gotta be like a... Wait, how many sides is that? I have to talk to all three of them. This is need to establish camps. What? Okay, use the supplies that the builders brought to establish camps in the ancient prison, the earthbound cavern, and the streambound cavern. It's like setting up the minigame, I feel. Or the dungeon. All those two are nicely. You already have everything you need for now, okay. So, can I go through here? Oh, it's an open gate. I didn't realise, I thought it was down. Or did it just open when I walked through it? Oh, that one's open too. I'm tripping. Oh, it's like a different room for each one. Interesting. So there's like three different, four different rooms and the antechamber and this thing where the boss fights happen. Looks like you might be able to pick some of these mushrooms maybe to make potions. Oh, some cockatrice down there. They might give supplies as well. Moths. Build camp spot. Looks like a construction spot. Oh, give me energy back. Interesting. Okay, so I think that's this one done. Can we get back through that? Ah, oh, so that might be the boss of the area. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna lead me, yeah, to the blue moon. I get it, I get it. Oh, but you can go across to the other ones. So I can go across to the streambound cavern. And I guess it's the cooking spot that I'm looking for because it turns into a cooking spot. So I'll build camp spot down there. Oh, and there's more of the monsters that we saw earlier. And then I guess there isn't a way straight across. So we'll go back to the antechamber. Maybe some stuff to mine here, I don't know. No, but what is this place? Clay oh, is this the rewards room? That makes sense. Some more morphs. Oh, we're back in this area. Wait. Or is it just one more? Oh, okay, so it's another cavern. They just look kind of similar. It was a different one though. Back to the middle. Okay, bit of exploration done. Oh, it's this one we want to go to. Oh, that's miles away. Collect from grubby sapling. Okay, so there's definitely some, like, way to make potions in here. I'm guessing some of the things that you can kill will drop food that you can cook. I don't know what else you'd need. I know you're supposed to be able to be self-sufficient in here, which is really cool to me, so... I'm guessing I need to just go for all the options. So I am. Just see if she's worked out what it says. What I just did. What do we do now? Found an earth and water talisman. Oh, go to the magic shop. Okay. Is this the exit? I like how the option is squeeze through door. 
That's cute. I don't know if it's like that in Kelda Grim or if they just don't have doors there. Uh, not sure. I don't want to talk to this guy. Did he do something? Okay. Blacksmith. Looks over there. The cool looking forge. Much cooler than any of the ones in our place. Blacksmith don't have a name. He's just Blacksmith. Steady on Torag. Four Smith in there. There's so many weird words. I wish they just used more normal words. It would make it so much easier to keep track of everything. Return to Naportsley and use these talismans. Is this Naportsley? East. I can see all the people now, so it's no longer like an instanced area. Still saying East. I think I kind of preferred it when it was instanced. <laughs> West. Okay. The talisman rests in your hand. What's that mean? Oh, shit. Uh, in a bit. Go to the antechamber, okay. Oh, it is a 20-sided. Okay, what do they want? Bream scales, a moss lizard tail, and moonlight grub paste. What the fuck? How do I gather that? I don't have any of it. Any of the... Where can I find a bream? Fish. Bushes. But I don't have any of the tools for that. Like, I don't have a fishing net or anything. I don't know what I need. Moonlight moth. Did I need that? Moonlight grub. That's a grimy lizard. There's a fishing spot there. Need a big net. Okay. It's confusing. Can you... Oh, there's supply crates. Maybe they have things in them. There we go. Fishing supplies. Okay. Hunting supplies. Herbal supplies. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright, let's have a go at fishing. Bream. We needed bream, didn't we? Bream scales. Cutting that? Okay. Just get the one. What's the other thing we need? Moss lizard tail and a moonlight grub paste. That's a moonlight moth. Grimy lizards. Shall I just kill one of these? See if it gives me a tail. Cabbage seeds. These are grimy lizards, so they're not moth lizards. This will be a grimy lizard tail that you get, or oh, ancient fountain head. God, there's so much shit. I'm guessing I have to go into each cavern, because there's three different things, so. Wait, what's this one? I don't know where that's going to lead me. Oh, okay. Right, what we got here? Collect from grubby sapling. Is that a moonlight grub? Hey, that's another one done. Then I'm guessing we need to go to the other place for the last one. Okay, we'll drop the fishing net for now, because we know we can get it back whenever. I didn't really check out this place very much. I don't know if there is any lizards here. Unless it was those ones that I was next to before, that I killed one of. Moonlight grub paste. Oh, do I have to... Oh, there's grubby saplings here as well. There was something that liked to hide in a bush. I remember hearing that. It said something like they hide in bushes. Oh, we can get run energy here. Oh, that's so good. That is good. Everyone's just running around like headless chickens trying to figure out what the fuck to do. I'm going to go back to the centre and ask the person again because I can't remember what they were saying. Moss lizard tail. The north west. So it's over this way. Hiding in bushes. Russell bush. That looks like a sort of option we want. Learning which, uh, which doors lead to which caverns will be a big part of efficiency here, I think. Okay, now how do we get the lizards? Oh, we need to trap a rock. Okay. This half of the trap's been set up. I don't know what I said it will with. Can you just make as many of these as you want? Hey, there we go. Okay, cut its tail off. Perfect. Look at us go. We're learning. Okay, that's not a good one, apparently. Yeah, I just don't know where any of them lead yet. The layouts of the rooms as well, with the multiple levels, are a bit weird. Getting used to that. I'm just gonna drop all this shit now because actually I know I should to get I could keep the vial of water just in case. They asked me to mix this together. Look for my glyphs, they will protect and guide you. So I guess we just stand on them. I feel like I'm gonna have to go through these very carefully one at a time. Alright, I'm gonna go get some better gear. I don't know whether we're gonna need melee or ranged. Seeing a lot of people running around in melee. Seems like a safe bet. But I want more tanky gear. Because defense is supposed to matter here. So we probably want a ring of shadows. Torags. Dark rocks. 
the tankiest thing I have. Guess we'll go DF first rather than Defender. I don't know how to make like any of the potions, so I'm just gonna have to do normal potions. I don't know how much I'm gonna need. All right, I'm just gonna send it and see what happens. No idea what I'm gonna need to pray. The only thing I remember from what that chick told me was to stand in her circles. I should have made a copper. I'm gonna go make one. I don't mean IRL, I mean, probably don't even need to bring a stand because this exists. So I'm guessing you statue starts the fight, so I'm gonna just pop. Kind of annoying that that name thing is covering. Oh shit, I drank the wrong one. Okay, everyone's pretty melly, so I guess we're doing that. And we stand there. Oh. So is this just like the normal dungeon that we're doing now? We just have to run it once as part of the quest? I feel like we're supposed to keep those lit, but... I don't know how to light them. We don't have a tinderbox. Or fire spells. Did it just drain my prayer? I mean, I know what I'm slapping. I don't know what anyone else is doing. So if we have to punch this... Maybe I should bring, like, mage. Oh, that fire's lit. Oh my gosh, it didn't even die. I got my weapon back. Okay. Oh, what's happening? How, can I... Can you light the brazier? I just want to try it. Oh, okay, so I didn't need, like, a tinderbox or anything. Turned off my run. I'm not taking much damage here, at least, so... It's a good sign for how easy it'll be to get all these three done. All right. Got one done. On to the next one. How do we get there? Not that one. Not that one. That one. Blood Moon. Just repop before going in. Okay, everyone's pray melee, so I'm just gonna pray melee and avoid these blood things. I don't know if they're like tougher after the quest in the actual dungeon, but if they're not, then this is gonna be a piece of piss. I'm guessing I'm meant to be hitting this thing. I have really no idea. I'm guessing everyone got given a different star. Are they all melee then, these bosses? Two of them have been at least. Oh. Oh, is this the... Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a weird animation. I like it though. It's funky. Almost there. I wonder if we get loot for this first turn then. Very cool. One more to go. Oh, this isn't going to take me to the right place either. I ain't got a clue where I'm going. Okay, up there. I can get there. There we go. Pop up, in we go. The fuck? We got cutscene this time? Oh. What? Oh my gosh. Close to dying. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to look at them. Well, that was awful. Are we meant to stay in this? Behind it. Okay, definitely this one is the toughest of the three. I don't think I'm turning fast enough. Oh dear. Oh, I got it. <gasps> okay, so we did them all. I need some food. I guess I could... I know, like, I, I want to finish the quest, but I just want to, like, see what this food is when you cook it. A line net? Oh, you can actually, like, catch them quicker? That's kind of cool. Yeah, you can click on any of these three tiles to, like, manually catch them. That is really cool. I like that. I don't know if there's another fishing mechanic that does that, but there might be somewhere. Let's see what this heals for. Hey. That was, that was quite a bit, I think. That was like 20 or something. I don't know if I was meant to come here, but that's where I ended up. I'm just trying to get back to the center. Oh, this place is a fucking maze, honestly. This way, maybe. I don't know what this room's for. Like, what's the point in these dudes? I think there's a book in one of the chests I read. Maybe that gives information on 
the different mechanics. I still don't have a way to get my prayer up either, so like, there's got to be potions and stuff that you make, I just don't know how to make them yet. What now? I did return to them. Do I need to speak to all of them? Hey! Nice! It's a decent chunk of XP there. 40,000 Slayer. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Okay, so... I think they said Chamber to the Southeast is the Ancient Shrine. I just want to see if we can claim all for that first one. And figure out what all the different resources in this dungeon are. Pile of notes. Herbalist notes. We'll take the chef's notes as well. Chef's first. Okay. Also the moss lizards as well. You can eat. Okay, but we can't take them out. And they heal more depending on the skill of the chef who prepared it. So, like, bruise or anglers or whatever. Oh no, not based on hit points, based on cooking. Okay. No herb. Water and a crushed up grub. So all we do is need a grub? That's it? What's all the hunting for? Oh, they collected quick. Okay, so we crush those. Moonlight potion. It gave prayer? It just buffed all my combat stats as well. Didn't do ranged. Is it going to be different every time I drink it? Just trying to figure this place out. What are the butterflies for? There's butterflies or moths in there. I don't really know what they're for either. Moonlight moth. I want to catch one of these. The fuck? What just happened? Divine super defense. Isn't that what this gave me though? Yeah. The fuck's a moonlight moth do? Oh, do I need a jar? It restores prayer points. Okay. We need a jar. Let's see if there's other types of potions you can make. Maybe in the different rooms, the, uh... doesn't give energy, does it? They might have different piles of notes in different rooms. Although, that being said, one of these notes mentioned the lizards which are in the other room, so... I'm not sure if that's accurate. I think these other two quests are just the, like, hunter stuff. So we go around here, mushroom wormlings, like, we don't know what these are for either, do we? What do these drop? All the moonlight cockatrice. Wormling bones? Surely it's not just bones, though. That'd be a random thing to include, just to... Unless the bones had a purpose. Is there a reason this doesn't give you butterfly jars when you need butterfly jars? I think that's kind of fucked up, if I'm honest. Oh, we didn't check the notes, did we? Okay, same notes. Right, yeah, let's try this again. I want to cook one of these plucks, see what it gives me. But it appears you can't get ranged potions, but I think the bosses are all melee anyway, so... I got an additional cut of meat. I have no idea how much it heals, because I'm on full. This place is interesting. Very interesting. Alright, what I want to do... I want to figure out how to get the Quetzal Feed, or whatever it's called. Hunter's Loot Sack. Because I want to build a transport thing here, otherwise I won't be able to get back here, will I? Because that's the only, like, transport anywhere near. I don't know if that's... Is that the one that we came in at? Yeah, that is the one that we came in at, isn't it? So I guess that's the closest thing we have to it. Is there a group teleport? No. What's the quickest way back is what I'm thinking. I don't really know how to get there. If we don't have this. You need this, don't you? So you need to get Quetzal Feed, which is apparently from Hunter's Loot Sacks. Which you get from the Hunter's Guild, which is down here. I don't know if we have the transportation option just yet. We could check. I don't know the quickest way back to the, like, the centre is. I guess teleport to Varrock maybe, but... Shall I just go for a kill them all once? While I'm here. Because we've got these weird potions that... Oh, check the rewards chest. It's telling me to. Okay. Yeah, honestly, navigating this is a bitch. I'm sure I'll get used to it, it's just... Figuring it all out. Is it this one? Here we go. Claim. Swamp tar, soft clay, harolander, irrit leaf, and some blessed bone shards. Okay. Used with jug of blessed wine at the libation bowl. 
the wiki is like sort of getting filled in as the day goes on but there's not too much there all right well that is uh i guess the quest done for perilous moons try to try and figure out how to get the fuck out of here i don't know why i can never use this door what's the point in it i feel like there should be a way back to the entrance from here rather than making me run all the way back to this thing okay that's perilous moons done for now i actually think i'm going to stay a little bit longer though i'm kind of curious to just like do it for an hour and see how it feels not bringing stuff in with me just getting all my supplies inside uh, i think that'll be quite an interesting sort of way to do it all right i'm going to take a short break have a little snack and then come back and do some perilous moons I'll probably be a video of its own this might be a separate i might have do yeah probably have made that into like a quest video with the other quests whenever i do them a few moments later hey everyone back to get on with the other two quests they're both short one's short and one's very short so i don't think they'll take too long but i've been figuring out other stuff around uh valamore as i've been as i've been going and i figured i'd show off what the bone shard thing is and also there's this teleport so yeah you get that teleporter at level 54 to here, which is right next to our Renew, our bird. Uh, so, if you already have bone shards, then you can skip the first part of this process. But if you don't have bone shards, you can take any types of bones, including the ones, that, the worm bones that we get in Perilous Moons. And you can bless them. And then once they're blessed, you break them down into bone shards. Now you, you shouldn't spam click because that it's like Winter Todd. It doesn't work if you spam click. You gotta like wait a tick and then if you click it again, that's how you get to do it fastest. You can just let it sit on auto as well, but it's a bit slower. So the first part of this is to get yourself some bone shards. Now there are other ways to get bone shards. This is just a default way that you can turn any bones into shards. And this fella here can unnote bones for you. So you can bring a stack of node bones and just come back and forth here. The second part of the process then requires you to have some wine. Just get them and get some more bones while we're there as well. I don't know if there's a quick way to get back to it, but this is the way that the way I found. Uh, and the wine also needs blessing on this altar. So we go up there, uh, jugs of wine will turn into blessed wine. Uh, the blessed wine can't be banked or drank, so that's worth worth paying mind to. But once you've got your blessed wa wine and your bone shards, we head back over here where we found Metzli in the quest to this marked object here. And basically every 200 shards that you crush, it uses a jug of wine and fills it up again. And you get 500 XP for every 100 shards, doing 100 at a time. So yeah, that's that's how this works. Uh, we, like, yeah, you bring bones here, sacrifice them. And then there are some types, like there were some sun-kissed bones that we got from the... Uh, Perilous Moons thing, they were just like already blessed so you could just crush them straight away uh, And that's basically Basically the process All right, we are going to try the hunter quest first, which I believe is over here And I think there's a fairy ring. But I'm not sure what the code is AJP Okay, oh no, we can't use our quest point cape we don't have all the quests done yet. Cheer! <laughs> well, it's a good job we're next to a ring anyway. It said invalid location, but it took me there. I guess it doesn't recognize it yet. But yeah, it is a valid, uh, valid location. So the hunter spot there, this is where our farming patch is. 
I'm guessing. Unless there's another one in the capital. Can't see one from a brief glance. There's a maze shop there. Oh yeah, there's a farm in patch up here. That'll be the herb patch. Who knows what this is. But there is a quest down here. One of the two. Should we just go do it? I think this might be the very short one. Yeah. This might just be like a little fun thing. Ah, oh, the capybaras. So is this like the guy that's obsessed with penguins, but with frogs? Okay, all we need for this quest is wood cutting, apparently. Are these the frogs? How do I investigate the frogs? I mean, they're here, but... Or is it these frogs? Oh, they can talk to them. Uh, okay. Just on strike. We really uh, broker in a peace agreement between a man and some frogs. I'm with it. Why is that a new tree patch as well? Wow, this is a fun little quest. I don't remember this being announced at all, but this is just like a, a fun little thing. I like it. Okay, so I need to sabotage this lily pad without Dave and Jane seeing, apparently. Ready for the hop off. Can I distract them? Orange. Oh, I don't have an axe. Is there a bank nearby? Hunter's Guild, not really. Is there an axe nearby? Will he give us one? Oh, there's a tool, leprechaun. They don't have axes though, do they? I don't have any money. The jug, table, chest. Surely there's gotta be like a bronze axe somewhere. Damn. Right, I'm just gonna run over to the guild. Okay, first time in the Hunter Guild. We're not staying for long though. Just wanna use the bank chest. Okay, getting an axe. I think he wanted oranges. I don't know if we have any. No, we don't, but there were an orange tree. Right, there's an orange tree. Although there's no cut option on it, so I guess. Ah. Oh, do we get a cutscene? Yes, we get to watch the hop off! In a bit, mate. See you later, cuff. Okay, so the frogs kill the fries, and they get oranges in return. So he's saying the flies don't need dealing with. I like the frogs. Fuck this guy, he's an idiot. The frogs should take over. I'm guessing this is what the locked chest in his house is for. Can we pickpocket him? Oh no, there's a... Fuck. Frogs. It's got to be on it. These, these letters aren't in order, I've just realised. Wait, is frogs... is F not even on here? Oh shit. And a love letter? Nalia. Let's go. We find a gnome child plushie. Give that to some flies, I'm sure they can carry it. Somehow. Nothing happens. Oh, plant evidence. The fuck? Cuthbert just came at me from the grave, what's going on? That's mad. Are we not going to address the fact that I, like, just killed Cuthbert? What if they, like, declare war on me for killing him? All right, oh, so that's a hardwood farming patch. Okay, so we can put an extra Morgan here or a Teak down there. Nice! Finally got one other than Fossil Island. Very interesting. Okay, I've just got this one quest left to do. I don't think I'm going to get it done before I go to eat, but I'll at least make a start on it. Guildmaster. Behind the bar in the borough. Oh, underground. Ah... Uh, who the fuck's wolf? Oh, wolf. Yeah, I was going to say we were like two meters away. Do all the animals talk here? So we need hunter, herb, lore, and construction for this. Look for him near the pyre foxes. Guessing that might be a hunter boost. Right, where are these pyre foxes then? Near the locust oasis, is that what it said? On the way to the oasis, okay. Fox fur. Pyre fox. Where is my man? This isn't your trap. Oh, I was just trying to, there he is. Is that him? What? Oh, fox. Is he chilling or is he hurt? Okay, so I think we need box traps. Uh, leaves from two nearby plants. Not seeing any other plants. I need boxes. I also need to know what the fuck a jaboa is. Oh, that's a jaboa. Right, I'm just gonna get anything that's possibly hunter related. Right, that's a Jaboa. Well, that's only one Jaboa. Where are the other Jaboas? Oh, fuck are they? Oh, there's one. Just put a few down, I guess. I can't really tell where the hunting ground is for them, so... Well, I 
haven't caught a single one yet. They're just walking straight past them. Are these the wrong type or something? From an ember tailed. Are these not ember tailed ones? Maybe they're not. Okay, let's have a little venture. Finnick fox. More boas. Lots of foxes. I don't know if these are the right types. Oh, ember, ember tailed. It's an attack option. Oh, maybe it's not. No, we just... Okay, so I don't know what the regular jabos are. Maybe you can't catch them. Hey, I got one. Okay, so we still need a plant. Another plant. I don't actually have really any time. I should be stopping. You need leaves from two different plants. Well, that's one of them. I don't know how far you have to go. It would help if you could tell me where the plants were, buddy. Not just... There's some plants. Like, that's very, very vague. I get you've got a head wound and all, but help me help you, mate. Maybe this guy can tell me. Fuck is the other plant? Alright, folks, I'm gonna, gonna finish this off after I've eaten, because my tickle is almost here, so yeah. See you all in a bit. Alright, folks, back here now to finish off the last quest. And I'm also going to see if we can do a couple hunter contracts. I would like to try and obtain some Quetzal feed. Ten can get us... Hey, that's a different... Ten, ten feed gets us uh, a new station. And I want to make one by the Perilous Moon's place. So I can quickly get back there. Because I have a feeling that I'll end up farming that content a fair bit. Okay, somewhere near the southwestern gate. How far are we? South Western Gate. Oh shit. That's like here, I think. This seems southwest. So I'll just run. I don't think we're far. I can't remember what this person's name is, but I remember it began with an A. I'm not seeing anyone around here though. It wasn't it really a That's uh, an outer fortis. Southwest. So outer is this outer fortis. Where the fuck is that, sir? Where they at, sir? Hey? Hey? Hey! There they at, sir. I don't have a hammer. There's a hammer there. Okay. Well, it's a good job I got an extra Jabota tail. Just by chance. Alright. No. Okay. Go speak to the guild master. Oh. And there it is. Okay. So I'm guessing if we've got access to master tier, then we've got access to all tiers. Let's go get a rumor and see what happens. Can we get a master yet? I'm guessing we're not high enough level, but 91. So he's adept, expert, okay expert is 72, so a red salamander, so that's the Arania hunt place, okay, what do we need to catch a salamander, a net, a small fishing net right, and a rope, I've already gone both, so we need a way to get to Arania which is going to be our decloak, and then I guess a way to get back. There is a eagle here, so I can just teleport. So I think you've just got to catch, like, what it tells you to catch until you find something that's not the usual thing. Like, until you catch a unique one. At which point it will hopefully be evident. Hopefully it doesn't take too long, but we'll find out. I mean, I'm not going to sit here for an hour trapping salamanders, I'll tell you that much for free. Jeez. How to revive dead content. I can't even... Somebody's already here, bro. Let me... Please tell me I'm not gonna have to hop worlds to find fucking salamanders. Oh, this is daft. This is actually daft. Bro, let me have one. Why is this guy so BM? I got it. Fuck you. This is mine. I should have brought extras. I didn't even know you could have three at once. This is gonna be rubbish, though. How are you meant to... If this is the only spot for them as well... How are you meant to... Wait, did I get that or did he? Wait, oh, that was his. I don't know why my thing showed up. I hate that I'm having to fight this guy for fucking salamanders. What is the world coming to? Oh my god, I didn't even get it. Every world is just going to be full. I really need an extra net and rope door to be able to do this efficiently. Are there any, like, new... It doesn't say what they are, so you can't see if there's, like, what's there. It doesn't say what the, what's at the spot. I feel like I might actually have an Arania teleport in the bank. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go check and get 
an extra rope and net twice. Uh, I don't have another net. Okay, I thought I had another small fishing net. I guess I'll just go buy one. Yes, I do have a Rainier teleport. Nice. All right, got three different traps set up. Let's see how how quick we can get this special salamander boy. I'm just going to change the left click to release because I never want them. I don't think they're useful for anything. Oh, there we go. Didn't take too long. No count on it, but it wasn't too long. Let's see how many Quetzal feed we get for that. Oh, we might get all the resources from it as well. From the reward sack. It's like a farming contract. Who's this guy? I want it. Four fourth XP. I mean, it's okay XP, but it's not great. This is a tier two loot. We got eight sunkissed bones, some raw kayak, some lander, and some fox. Oh, and one quetzal feed. I'm gonna swap this guy to room. Okay, we'll do another couple, see. Pyre fox. That's what he said, isn't it? That's something nearby, I know that. I don't know how we trap it, though. Not seeing no foxes. Where the foxes? Southeast. Not down there, are they? That's like the beach. It's not a hunter place. Wait, am I. Oh, I'm going southwest, that's why. Maybe get the right direction. I'm really bad at east and west. I don't know what it is. I always get them mixed up. It's weird. My sister's bad at left and right. I'm bad at east and west. Very directionally challenged, I guess. Oh gosh, this is going to be impossible, isn't it? Okay, now the world hopping begins again. I don't recommend doing any hunter tasks in the next two days if you want to have any fun at all. I mean, I don't recommend doing hunter tasks if you want to have any fun at all, but... It's going to be rough out here for the next couple. Oh, somebody was already on it. I bet literally every hunter spot is taken in every world, which is wild. This many people actually engaging with a skill that none of them enjoy. And I'm sat here with them. What a fuck wit. I think it's literally impossible to hunt right now. Like every single world. Okay, my day one review of the Hunter's Guild is no content is doable. Oh my god, I actually got a boulder. Been here for like 20 minutes just hopping trying to find a single boulder. I gotta hold on to this boulder with my life. How long does a fucking tree take to grow back? My word. Like, honestly, that tree is taking the piss. We don't actually need this fur, do we? Because that'd suck if I was just dropping it all and it was really valuable. I mean, it's not like I can use the GE, so... Oh, you can make a small meat pouch with it. Well, maybe I should. You need four of them? Shit, I need a log! No, don't let me lose that, don't let me lose that. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that guy just sniped my tree, I'm fucked. It's over. Somebody's got it. Oh no. We're doomed. Oh, they've gone. No, they haven't. But be quick. Yes! Not crashing me, motherfucker. Okay, so I need four fox fur needle and thread. I don't think there's any point keeping more than four. And the competition for trees is as bad as for the fucking rocks. How fucking far I've gone from the spot just to get a tree. The good thing is, my trap gets kept there. So it sort of like secures the spot. No one can come along and steal it. Someone's trying to steal it. Not gonna happen, mate. Taking a while to find the special thing. Wait, is there a free one here? Can you do two at once? No. Review after actually being able to sit here for like 10 minutes and do it. Uh, Hunter's still shit. It's just now shit that is mandatory to unlock transportation links in Valamore, which I can't say I'm a big fan of. Uh, it hasn't made the shit thing less shit, it's just made me have to do the shit thing. I literally just want to get a bird next to Perilous Moons, because it seems like a long run to get back there every time otherwise. But this isn't looking promising. Maybe lower tier contracts are better for building up this Quetzal feed, I don't know. Maybe it's just really slow. 
Is the meat used for something? Oh, yeah, it's a resource. Okay. So you use it to charge some teleport whistle that brings you back to the Hunter Guild. So maybe I should have been keeping more of this. That's why you want the pouch, so you can keep the meat and use it to charge the whistle. I see. It's all making sense now. Wow, you need three spaces. I'm going to get four just in case you need four to get the bonus piece. Honestly, if I don't get it in the next five minutes, I'm out of here. This is boring as shit. It's not that good XP. Like, it's very poor XP in comparison to all the methods I could be doing. It's not fun. There's no sense of progress. I almost feel like I'm catching the wrong thing. I'm almost certain that they said Pyrefox. There's no way to, like, check, though, is there? Maybe there is, but I don't have it yet. I feel like I've caught, like, a hundred of these. I think I'm actually going to separate this portion from the questing bit and just make this a video called hunter's still shit because it is like oh, yeah they haven't they haven't improved anything here the guild might be cool but it needs fine tuning because this task is taking like a year and it's supposed to be a quick thing at least in my head it is like, I'm trying to unlock a transportation system so that I can fully enjoy the content that you've made for me. But I can't fully enjoy the content you made for me because I don't have a transportation system and you're making me collect 10 Quetzal feed from this stupid fucking task that doesn't seem to want to complete. This is a bad update. I'm not saying everything about the update is bad. A lot of the content I've been really enjoying so far, this particular aspect of it, the hunting, uh, is far by far the worst part like there's no new content here it's just the same hunter but now you have to do it or you can't get around the place it's sort of just a rant but it's kind of annoyed me that i have to unlock my transport and this is the way to do it i don't think there's any other way to get this like you need 10 per spot like I, there's a bunch of spots on the, the transport system it's gonna take fucking forever. I mean, what, I could go and like, get an easier contract maybe, but that seems like a bad method if the new content that you just released, the Pyrefoxes, are uh, literally too shit to do. It's not a great look. Let's see what happens if I go down here and talk to the Adept. A rare horned Grack. The fuck is a horned Grack? Right, Karam Jonah area, teasing stick. I think that's all you need. Knife and logs. While we're at it, let's just make ourselves a pouch. Okay, we have a small meat pouch. AKA my testicles. I'm kidding, my dog testicles. Oh, I actually found a spot that's not that busy. Okay, we're getting meat for this thing now as well. Oh, and there we go. We got it straight away. Maybe it was just that other task that. Because, like, somebody else said they'd had it and they were super dry there, like, twice in a row. So maybe it's something to do with that specific, like, Pyrefox task. If it is, and it's just bugged right now, then some of my unamusement could be taken back. But not all of it. I've forgotten what that fucking fairy code was, and it's not going to have saved, because it said it didn't exist. AJP. AJP. A Jaboa? place? AJP? A Jaboa place. If you can remember the word Jaboa, which you probably can't. Don't know if we need Grack for or anything, but... Grack, 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 boom, boom. Uh, didn't I get a thing for you? Oh, there's two. I didn't realise there were two for each. We don't get any feed to that time? Alright, I'm Border Hunter. It took that long, like five minutes. And now I've probably just filled up my bank with loads of random shit. And my bank is already struggling for space. I can't deposit my boots. I need to clean some space out of my bank. And then I think I'm just going to go chill at Perilous Moons for the rest of the night. Because it was fairly chill. And I don't know what else to do. Guess we'll alk some of the loot we got from various places. Yeah, I'm kind of broke at the minute. Because, like, I'd just been doing a whole bunch of the Abyssal Demons. So, like, all my money went on runes. It's been, like, five mil. But we can make some money back. It's not a problem. Just need to dedicate some time to it. So, I'll see you in a bit for whatever the next video is. Hope you've enjoyed this one. And if you did enjoy the video, please do make sure to leave a like. It helps a ton. 
both for promoting me into the algorithm and just for letting me know that you enjoy the content I'm creating, so I know to keep doing it. Yes, this is an outro recorded at a different time because I didn't know what the content was going to be when I recorded it. There's tons more still to come in terms of Valamore. I've got a Perilous Moon's first hour video that I'll be editing soon after this one. I've got the same thing for the Colosseum first hour there. I'll be editing that at some point. We've got some more Perilous Moon stuff after that, I think I recorded last night. Honestly, I've got so much footage already and there's so much to go through. I also have one hour limit locked, my other series, which is still continuing. I'm going to be recording an episode after that as soon as I've got this one this video out and uh, had some food. So yeah, tons of content to come on the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you see it all. Leave a comment down below. Let me know how you're excited about Valamore. If there's bits that you like or bits that you don't. I know we sort of ended on a weird note with the Hunter in this video because Hunter is still shit. But for the most part, I've been really enjoying this expansion. The Colosseum's cool and I have tons more to learn there. Perilous Moons, pretty cool. Pretty chill as well. There's some nice AFK activities between the pickpocketing and the prayer and stuff. Generally, quite a fan of what they've done here. But that is going to be all for this one. So until the next time, look after yourself. Be lovely to one another. I'll see you on the next one.